Hello. Well, first I must say that I accidentally kind of lied because I said that I would be only playing on that other file. That's not true. I'm actually going to also be playing on the server that my friend has. No, you cannot know what server it is. But, um... Uh, this is, uh, one of my friend's server. Yeah, so... That, uh, that's one of my friends right there that's talking. Um, first I'll give a tour around my base, I guess. So, I guess the first thing to do would be go up to the top and show you this entire world. Yep. So right now, this base is built on top of a huge mountain. Um, and that guy, Waster, I guess is how you pronounce his username. Um, well, his base is right over there, that one, way over there, but this is mine. Whoa, what's that huge crystal structure? I've definitely not seen that before. Um, my home is set in this pool of water right here, and then let me show you the other features of my base. So right here it's not finished yet but I'm going to be making the hang gardens of Babylon um, that looks awesome um, and then over here we have oh okay fraps is having high CPU usage um, right here we have my lava pool it's kinda pitiful but it's just because I was cleaning up my other base see that down there that pitiful little thing surrounded by the sand wall. That's what my original base looked like. Um, I have a staircase that leads from that, and the staircase is right there, where the cursor thing is pointing. Um, it goes up to here, but it's actually, even though spiders can climb walls, it's impossible for them to get up here because of um, it goes over the edge of the stuff. Actually, right there. Hmm. Whatever. Um, but all the, monsters, all the mobs are down there, and they can't get in. Um, yeah, Waster is one of my good friends. I'm, I might show you his base in a little bit. First, I'll show you my old base that I've abandoned. It's on top of a nice sized hill itself. But, this used to... Okay, there's definitely a zombie in here. Somewhere. But, um, that water filled thing was, um, used to be what my quarry was. Um, but then someone griefed my base down there so okay whatever I'm gonna go to Waster's base home uh, by the way this server is running the bucket mod um okay I hear fire there's some of obsidian um this is a staircase down into his mine, which I'm not going to go down there. Um, he's got a Minecraft cart ride to his underwater base, which I might do in a second if I'm not too bad at riding mine, mine carts like I usually am. Let's see if he has one here for us to ride. There we go. Um, so here we go. No, no, no. I'm bad at riding mine carts. Uh, I fail. So bad at riding minecarts. I don't even. Does anyone. If you have any tips about how to ride a minecart, please say so in the comments. That would really make me happy. Okay. Maybe you're just supposed to get in front of the. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. We're going fast. It's downhill. Um. Ugh. Lame. Why is there another. Oh, yeah, I put that there. Put 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 put. Hopefully this can go fast enough. Hey, look! It looks like he started a mine or something down there. I am hearing water. Also, should I have Windows 7 sound on? By the way, tell me what you think of my base when you see it. Okay, I'm really. Oh yeah, so this is the second episode of the Minecrafter.
and I'm hoping to have one maybe up every two days or something. I'm almost there. Um, oh, oh, right, right down there, right down there. Come on, come on, you can do it, little minecart. You can do it, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. Put, 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 put. Wow, that must be the surface right there if there's grass growing on top of them. Is it really refusing to go downhill? I think it's physically refusing to go downhill. But as soon as I get out, it'll start going downhill. See? See, what did I tell you? So I'm going to destroy that again. And I guess I'll get in another minecart. See, I'm really bad at mine riding minecarts. Um, but hopefully this time it'll actually work pretty well. Um, so yeah, this is my friend's server, and none of you are welcome here. Sorry. Because it, it's just exclusive, just friends of... Yeah. Whoa, whoa, okay, what? Oh, mm, uh, oh, mm. Okay. Well, now I'm in his um, aqua base, which is unfinished. Okay, so I got that minecart. Is this what I saw from above? Whoa. This is awesome. Keep in mind that this is all underwater. This is so incredibly awesome. Another good trick that um I discovered that I didn't discover but some other people told me. A water and lava can't come in through your door even if the door is open. So that's I'm probably gonna make another aqua base I'm probably gonna make a aqua base eventually after I finish my base in the sky. Underwater quarry. That's cool. Oh hi there. Hmm, my skin isn't on my guy. So, yeah, this guy has a cool aqua base. I'm going to go back to my home. And then I'm going to help one of my other friends. Um, whoa. Okay. Oh, no. But first, I have to return his minecart. Home. Whoa. Washer 79. Minecart return. Somehow, I always end up using two. So that's my minecart return, and then I go back to my house. You know, come to think of it, I couldn't see any squids outside. And I got my nice collection of torches. <laughs> I might, I could possibly need those. I'm going to go to my, um, then I'm going to Dormat's base to help him with his underground sanctuary castle. Um, because he let, because he's excavating this huge cavern, um, but the thing is, he um, he'll let me keep any like minerals or anything that I find down there, um, just as long as I um, don't mess up the shape of the cavern. So it's a pretty good deal for me. Uh, okay. Okay. So. Wow, it's lagging a bit, but I don't really want to turn off the visibility. So I guess people watching this will have to suffer a little bit of lag then I'm putting these iron ore into my furnace into my furnace into my furnace okay maybe I do want to change the quality um no not invert mouse normal okay now it's, yep now it's working better 
Oh, I don't have any. Oh, I don't. Oh, I don't have any wood to put in there. I have wood in the other room. Then I'll go over to Matt Doormat's base. Mm, there we go. This should do it. But yeah, this is. I definitely don't like playing on uh, single player that much. So. Okay, really? It keeps on saying that I don't have permission to warp there. Okay. So I guess I'm not going to be working on that. But I'm intrigued by that. So I'm going to warp to spawn. Ah! I forgot. I forgot the uh, thing. Okay. So... I'm going to show off my friend Aush's, yes, the same Aush that plays Atmosphere, uh, my friend Aush's old destroyed base that got completely destroyed. I need to make a mine. I think I'm going to make a mine and have a mine cart ride up, up to the mine. That'd be pretty cool. Oh, but I forgot what the formula is for crafting uh, mine carts. Okay, so I think his base is right over here. Yeah, it's right in there. And he got griefed a while ago, so... Hmm, which way is which? I don't remember which way is his base. Um, I'll show you his other base in a minute, but... Hmm. I think this is his old mine. Yeah, this is definitely his old mine. Well, maybe it's not. I don't know. If I get lost, I can always warp to home. Um do 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 Yeah, I'm pretty sure that this is his mine. Though he had a giant underground base facility. Okay, those torches oh, never mind, this is where it is. Uh where do, where do I have to go? I forget where I have to go. There's a certain way that I have to go around this bedrock place to be able to get in. I think I have to go down and uh then up and over and um now where do I go? Do I go in here? Okay, it's completely dark in here. I'm going to Aush's new base. There we go. Uh there's his, this is his supplies room. He's got some Wow, he doesn't actually have that many blocks in here, I'm surprised. Um, oh, and of course he has a ton of stuff that I don't. Um, uh, miscellaneous items. Yeah, he has a watch, and, uh, yeah, he has all that stuff. Uh, and I still don't know how ver we're very well how to redstone program. This is his infinite spring, which I showed him how to make yesterday. He didn't know how to make an inf infinite spring. Imagine that. Uh, th that's his mind. I don't want to go down there. Um, what, this is his cooking and crafting room. And this is where someone used hacks to have an uber... See, look. Someone hacked to make an uber shaft down to the bottom. So it, go, it went straight through Aush's base. So <laughs> it stinks for him. Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot. There's a pressure plate. I'm going up to the surface. Wow, this is actually pretty deep underwater. Okay, now I'm going to see what that huge crystal ball is. Because it looks like it might eventually get in the way of some of my constructions. Ooh, a boat. Hey, there's a ton of boats. I wonder where... Whoa, there's a huge tunnel through the... I've never seen any of this. Wow, I only have like 45 seconds left in this uh, episode. That is awesome. That globe of glass. Ooh, look, a jack... a pumpkin. A jack of pumpkin. That's definitely someone's base. I need to find out how to get up there. But I think that my time with you guys today is ending. Oh, yeah, that must be um, Sir Vanji's base. Uh, it must be part of Sir Vanji's base. Uh, I'll check it out some other time. But for now, this is Maximum Dragon uh, signing off from the Minecrafter, saying, I'm going to figure out the mystery of this strange, strange globe. Okay, see ya.